Welcome back guys, this is Alcoholic Endeavors, and today we are going to be making a um, Harvey Wallbanger. Uh, my co-worker, she's been begging me to make this video for a very long time now, and I just either didn't have the stuff to do it, or I got busy with other stuff and then forgot about it, which that's a very high possibility. Sorry, forgive me, I kind of fucked that up. I meant to do it a long time ago. I either forgot, like I said, or I just got this not too long ago. Um, I think it was maybe about a month ago. Unfortunately, a lot of these videos that are going to be coming out will probably be like many months later, uh, except this video because that's probably going to come out sometime in August, I think. Oh, maybe they'll quote me on that one because, no, yeah, it'll be sometime in August. It'll probably be the first week, week of August. Um, because I, again, I meant to take the, I meant to pull this out and just either forgot or I didn't have enough uh, stuff. Again, I haven't been recording for about a month or so. And, uh, yeah, I finally got this like maybe a month or two ago and either just forgot. There's a very good high possibility I just forgot. Uh, there was a lot of drinks that I wanted to do and never got around to it. Uh, there's times that I've gotten somewhat sick from them because I was stupid and did something stupid. Done that before. Not a surprise for me. Yeah, I did it. Anyways, we're going to be doing the Har Harvey Wallbanger. I know I said that before, but I figured I'd reiterate. We're going to need some ice for our glass. Um, I'm not going to do too much ice because most of this ice is melted and I need some of this ice for later videos. I have 151 running through me. You'll probably notice it a lot later in some of the other videos I do, and you'll be like, ah, yes, this must be the session that he did, and go, yeah, he got really drunk there. My editor's gonna have fun. Oh, yeah! I don't edit videos too often much anymore, which is very thankful for me. Love you, buddy. I probably should explain what's going into the Harvey Wallbanger. Uh, you'll need a vodka of some sort. I'm gonna use Absolute Vodka since I already have 150 proof running through me. I'm not gonna put in Everclear because that seems like a horrible idea for me right now. You'll also need Gallo. Uh, it's a sweet vermouth. I think there's regular vermouth. I have sweet uh, vermouth. Yeah, God. Uh, sweet vermouth. I didn't get the regular, so I'm hoping the sweet will be perfectly fine. Um, and you will also need orange juice, preferably orange juice that hasn't expired. Uh, mine is still good for at least another week, somehow. Because I think I bought that like a month ago. Ooh, look at me. I'm going to use this cup to pour in the orange juice because I do not trust myself to pour orange juice into this little jigger. Hmm, I haven't washed this out yet. But, no, nah, it should be fine. Was the sucking necessary? No. You know what, I'm not gonna go there. Uh, everybody else will go there, probably my editor might go there, but I'm not gonna go there. So the first thing you need is an ounce of vodka. And I am going to attempt to pour in the other direction. I've been bad about this, so. And then you need a half ounce of Kleno. Half an ounce of Galeno, and then four ounces of, oops, I never took this off. Apparently it's a new bottle, and it's gonna expire in a week. Anyways, you'll need four ounces of orange juice, preferably already shaken. I shaked it earlier, so I'm hoping it'll be fine. That's about four ounces, I think. I'm gonna pray it is. Any bartenders watching my channel, which, uh, there's only, I think there's only like one per, one bartender watching my channel. Um, he's going to hate me because he'll be like, that's not four ounces, that's like three ounces. And I'll be like, yeah, I should have counted, but I didn't. So it's fine. Stir her on up. And this is apparently the Harvey Wellbanger. I might add a little too much Galeno into this um, or Gallo. Leno, Clout, and Gallo. Sweet mark for vermouth. I think I added like three fourths. So it might be a little might be a little up there. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and try it out. And if it is a little up there, I'll just add 
a hair a bit more orange juice, a hair, a hair a bit more vodka, and everything will be fine. Hmm. Yeah, I might. I, I I think I added just a hair a bit too much. Uh, Galeno. I think I added actually an ounce of Galeno by mistake. Because, well, I'm drunk and. Or I'm getting there anyways. And maybe just a hair bit more. As you can see, I'm the only one in this house that drinks orange juice apparently. Um, probably should mix this up a little bit. The first sip I took, it wasn't bad. It really wasn't. Um, it was very heavy on the orange juice. I'm not entirely sure. What is. Uh, Gallo, Galeno, Gallo, Vermouth. Is it, um, like a herby thing? Because I have a feeling it's supposed to be like a herby type of, um, Liqueur or liquor. I think it's liqueur. Yeah, it's a liqueur. Don't mind me, I'm just adding a little bit more to justify what's in this. It's a very... Oh, well, I mean, sweet vermouth. It's supposed to be sweet. Um, it's a very sweet... It's a sweet drink. It's not very strong. Well, depending on the vodka you use anyways. It's not very strong. It could be also that I still, again, had too much uh, raspberry liqueur in this uh, jigger that could have changed the taste a little bit. Didn't think about washing it out. Should have washed it out, but I didn't think it would make too much of a difference. But apparently it makes just a hair bit of difference because I can taste a little bit of raspberry with the orange. But it's not like an excessive amount of like raspberry liqueur with orange juice. Probably without the raspberry liqueur that was in the jigger, this would probably taste actually pretty damn good. I don't know if I would care for drinking it over and over and over again, but I would like to have it again at some point. You don't really taste like the I think Gal uh, Gallo or Galeno is a um, herby type of liqueur. Like it's, it, it, the way it's set up, it's like it's a hint of that. So it adds a little bit more of a, I want to say grassy, but it's not grassy. It's, it's still a herby, it gives the orange juice a little bit more sweetness, it's a little bit more herby, it's um, Herbie just doesn't explain it very well. It could be just me getting drunk and I don't know how to explain things anymore. Uh, very high possibility. Probably give him another drink or two and I'll be sitting there going, Oh my god, why did I do this? End it now. And then I'll continue for another three drinks and go, Yeah, no, I'm done. Um, anyways. Uh, it gives it a nice... It's... I would drink it again. Let's just go with that. I'll drink it again. It's not bad, but I don't think it's my style. Thank you to my coworker for suggesting this. If you like that, go check out my other videos. We now have a Discord link down in the description. If any of you guys have a drink or shot recipe, leave it down in the comment section below. Give me a like, comment, subscribe, and I hope to see you all next time.